I found the deed of Sassam. Roger's face was flushed with excitement. He'd been hardly able to contain himself, waiting with open impatience at the train station in Inverness, while Brianna hugged me and my bags were retrieved. He had barely got us stuffed into his tiny Morris and the car's ignition started before blurting out his news. What? For Lallybroch? I leaned over the seat back between him and Brianna in order to hear him over the noise of the motor. Yes, the one Jamie, your Jamie, wrote, deeding the property to his nephew, the younger Jamie. It's at the manse, Brianna put in, twisting to look at me. We were afraid to bring it with us. Roger had to sign his name in blood to get it out of the SPA collection. Her fair skin was pinkened by excitement and the chilly day raindrops in her ruddy hair. It was always a shock to me to see her again after an absence. Mothers always think their children beautiful, but Brie really was. I smiled at her, glowing with affection tinged with panic. Could I really be thinking of leaving her? Mistaking the smile for one of pleasure in the news, she went on, gripping the back of the seat in excitement. And you'll never guess what else we found. What you found, Roger corrected, squeezing her knee with one hand as he negotiated the tiny orange car through a roundabout. She gave him a quick glance and a reciprocal touch with an air of intimacy about it that set off my maternal alarm bells on the spot. Like that already, was it? <laughs>